What's going on, y'all? This is Shen. Glad to be back. Had to take a few days off. I was doing something, so... Here's one of the things I actually want to make sure everybody knew. And when I saw this, I was thinking of some old school stuff back on the PSP. But if you have one of the classic Nintendo 3DSs, you could hack your system for Magnet. Yes, it is just that easy. Um, I'll give all the instructions in the description below. So I wonder how many people are going to run out and go get a old 3DS just so they can be able to do custom firmware and get all their games for free and stuff like that. Remember back in the days when we had a Sony PSP and you can use a Pandora battery and you could be able to hack your PSP? You could actually be also to hack and make your own Pandora battery. And that way you can be able to hack PSPs on the fly for people. We're pretty much getting into that exact same thing. And it's wonderful. The good thing about this is if you have someone who actually has a brick or old 3DS, you could probably get it from them really, really cheap, if not for free. Turn around, use this trick, and now you have a hacked 3DS for free. Oh my goodness, I love it. Um, this one goes out to, oh, I'm going to say his name is completely wrong. Um, Cyrus M. I don't know how he says his name though, but give him props. His link will be in the description below as well. Enjoy it. Use it. If you, if you do use it, please come back. Let me know. Cause I'm about to go out and look for some old 3DSs just to try this out. Just for the hell of it. All right, y'all. This is Shin. I'm out.